So should you use retread tires or virgin tires on your semi truck? How's it going guys? This is James and uh, welcome back to the channel Make Money Trucking. And today we're going to be talking about whether you should do use retread tires or virgin tires for your semi truck. So basically you need to go into what is the difference between a retread or a virgin uh, truck tire. So basically retreads are, uh, they're basically exactly that, they're a retread. So they use a, what is called a casing on the bottom uh, part of the tire and then they put a tread patch on top called a cap and that is a retread. And then a virgin tire is uh, completely made from scratch. So just like if you're to get a car of a tire for a vehicle of yours, it's going to be exactly the same, uh, just like that. So it's a brand new tire. Both the casing and the cap are both uh, brand new, and they're meant to be molded together. And then uh, again, a retread is a used casing. That's the that's like the bald tire itself, and they put a new tread patch on top of that called a cap. All right, so basically, what are the pros and cons of both? So let's start with the retreads. Uh, the pros to a retread is that they're less expensive, so they're basically more cost efficient. And then, uh, you know, but what are the cons of a retread? So uh, on retreads, they have a tendency to peel. Uh, when you are driving down the road, in a lot of high in a high heat environment that top layer will actually peel up back from the actual casing itself um, This can be mitigated uh, if you get high quality casing So if you get like a good brand of casing and then a good brand of retread and there's different companies that do uh, retreads um, I would say that you don't have to worry too much about that <clears throat> and then so on virgin tires What are the pros and cons of those? <clears throat> so the cons of a virgin tire is obviously they're expensive. Um, that's pretty much uh, one of the cons. And then also, you know, if you uh, puncture a virgin tire, you know, on the sidewall or you have a big enough uh, hole that they can't repatch it, then uh, you're out that money. And then uh, what are the pros of a virgin tire? So the pros of a virgin tire is they're, if you, uh, they're less susceptible to heat so since they're made from scratch, brand new, um, that cap doesn't tend to peel from the from the casing itself. It's all one molded piece. So basically, um, if you're doing a lot of highway driving, then uh, it doesn't have a tendency to peel, and they'll last a little bit longer, and they'll tend to wear a little bit better uh, due to the fact that they didn't match a unknown casing to a um, tread cap on top. So then the virgin, it was all meant to be together. So you'll get a little more life out of those. One really quick note, guys, I'm going to be coming out with a video soon going over different tire pricings and how much it costs to put tires on your semi, going over both retreads and virgin tires. All right, back to the video. Now, which one should you run? Well, there's multiple different applications and reasons to run retreads versus running virgin uh, truck tires. So in my scenario, I'm more vocational. Um, I have shorter hauls. So basically I'm only driving for maybe an hour to two hours and then I'm stopped for about an hour or so to unload and load. And also due to my environment on the rough roads that I drive, basically off-road, um, dirt roads, in the oil field or in the construction industry, uh, the chances of getting something in your tire, like a uh, bolt, uh, rods, building material, you know, all types of foreign objects are a lot higher uh, likelihood in my case. So <clears throat> that would be a reason to use retreads if you're, it's more like you're, you have a construction truck and you're not, you know, running down the highway for hours and hours on end. <clears throat> and that would be the reason to run a retread. Now, the reason to run a virgin tire. If you're over the road or regional, you definitely want to run virgin tires. 
due to uh, back time of the pros and cons of virgin t or the pros of the virgin tires is that uh, they're they do better with heat. They don't peel apart or come apart with heat. Anything can happen with tires, but they're less likely. So if you run over the road, you definitely want to spend the extra money and get uh, virgin tires. Uh, they are going to be a little more expensive, but in the long run, that's going to do you a lot better. Because if you're driving, you know, 10 straight hours, you know, the tires are going to get a lot hotter. And then, you know, they're also going to, you know, the retreads could potentially come apart. So basically, that would be the two different uh, differentiations that I've ran into. I personally run retreads due to the huge cost savings of running retreads. And like I said, out where I run, I've gotten bolts that big in, in my tires. So basically, you can't patch a hole that big. And then also, you know, if you're doing a lot of off-road driving or you're going into locations that are rocky or uphill, uh, weird angles, uh, sidewalls get blown out all the time. Uh, so basically, running a virgin tire, to me, is just a waste of money. Now, you can mitigate the risk by running retreads by running a good brand of retreads um you know i typically i tend to run a michelin retread and they actually use michelin casings which is the you know the 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 sole tire itself and then they actually have a retread factory that puts a michelin cap on top so their quality is probably about you know 10 times better than a lot of the other retreads out there I've ran some other retreads that are okay, but they're not that great. Like there's a company called Bandag, and I think that's, uh, if I'm not mistaken, correct me if I'm wrong on this, I think they're Bridgestone. So that's about a Bridgestone tire that it's it's retreaded. Um, my only thing with those is I found that it's a lot, a little bit less quality on the casings. So when you get retreads, um, a good uh, tip here is it's all about the casings. Um, if you can get matching casings, meaning that uh, if a truck came in, and it had its, it needed all eight or ten of its tires, uh, or all eight of the tires swapped out. Uh, basically, they'll take those if they were good tires, like a good brand like Bridgestone, uh, Michelin, uh, BF Goodridge, you know, Goodyear, you name it, all all those uh, you know top brands. They'll take those and they'll specifically select those to to be retreaded. They can't retread every tire, and then uh, I guess another. Another pro uh, to the Virgin tires is that, like I just said, if you go into a shop and you need new tires, you have Virgin tires, they'll give you a lot more credit. Uh, they'll give a good tire credit for those tires that they pull off because that they can sell them or get them to a retread factory and have them retreaded. So they might give you a fifty to hundred dollar credit per tire due to that that scenario that they can uh, re that they can you know retread those. So that's another pro to virgins versus versus retreads. Um, also, uh, if you're getting retreads um, and like I haul heavy and off road, so I you can still get a 16 ply tire, uh, so you can get a heavier spec tire for the weight that you're hauling. Now this is for uh, this information is for truck your tractor, so your trucks out there. Um, as far as trailer tires go. Um, if you're running like low pro tires on like a step deck flatbed trailer, definitely you probably want to go virgins on those. I don't know if they make retreads for those, but uh, like us, we haul tank trailers uh, or dump trailers, and uh, those it doesn't hurt to run retreads because the same susceptibility to the truck getting blowouts is exactly the same with uh, the trailer tires, especially when you have a dump trailer or you're getting in some rocky areas dumping rocks or whatnot, there's a lot higher likelihood of having a sidewall blow up. So yeah, uh, that's basically the difference between a retread and a virgin tire and the different scenarios to run uh, one versus the other. If you're more local, you know, um, and you're off road a lot and you are susceptible to blowouts or tire damage as is like I am, I would run retreads. Just make sure you get good casings. Uh, matching if you can get the highest ply rating like 16 ply and then make sure they've been uh, capped by a good company and then uh, if you're over the road you know run virgins uh, that's probably what you want to do because those tires on the highway you know when they get when they get heat up they're just going to come apart all right guys so that's pretty much i got all i got for you today hopefully this was helpful uh retreads versus virgins hopefully this helps uh in your decision um, there's a lot of guys that'll die on that hill and only run virgins and I'm perfectly okay with that. If that's what you want to do and that's what you're comfortable with,
definitely do that, but I don't. I can save a little bit of money because when I go, you know, every couple, every month or so, I have a blowout anyways, so I get a, you know, puncture in my tire or whatnot. So I just run retreads due to my situation, but hopefully you guys found this video informative and uh, hopefully you learned something from it. And uh, like, subscribe, uh, leave some comments down below of some other uh, video ideas you want me to do, and I will see you guys on the next one. Thanks.